بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على عبده ورسوله الأمين نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين عمر may Allah be pleased with him narrated that the Prophet صلى الله عليه وآله وسلم said إنما الأعمال بالنيات Verily deeds are by their intention this hadith is one of the mainstream hadiths and the pillars of the religion of Allah. Imam Ahmad, Imam Shafi'i, all great scholars and imams of Islam made this hadith one of the principles that the whole of Islam revolves around. The second hadith is Hadith Aisha. Man ahdatha fi amrina. Whoever innovates in our religion, what's not part of it, it is rejected. And also the hadith of Al Nu'man ibn Bashir ibn Sa'd, may Allah be pleased with them, where the Prophet said, Alayhi salatu wa sallam, Al halal ubayin wal haram ubayin. Halal is clear and haram is clear. And there might be a fourth hadith here or there, or only three. What does hadith of Umar? May Allah be pleased with him, referred to. It refers to, it refers to a very crucial concept in Islam, and that is sincerity, al-ikhlas. See, you find two people doing the same act. One of them is elevated to Jannah, and the other is thrown into hell. Though the act is the same, what is the difference? The difference is what's in the heart, which is sincerity, which is ikhlas. The Prophet told us alayhi salatu wasalam, that among the first to be thrown into hell, three. A person who is knowledgeable of Quran, a person who gives money in charity, and a person who died on the battlefield. And each one of them is asked on the day of judgment what have you done in the favors and blessings that Allah had given you so the scholar or the knowledgeable person of Quran he said I learned the Quran and I taught it for your sake and Allah says you lie you did this so that people would say that he is a Qari that he is a learned person of Quran of knowledge and they had said that and he will be thrown and cast into hell. Sincerity is a very difficult thing because it's something in the heart and no one knows of. There are signs for those who want to know if they succeed or not, like giving charity in secret. One of the seven, one of the seven whom Allah Azza wa Jal would place in his shade on the day of judgment is a person who gives charity with his right hand in secret to the extent that even his left hand does not know what his right hand had spent for the cause of Allah. Sincerity is when no one knows that you're fasting, voluntary fasts, or that you are praying night prayer, or that you are making dhikr, or that you are reciting the Quran, it's something in the heart where you try your level best to devote and to have all types of worship solely and sincerely to Allah the Almighty. Not to show off, not to tell people that, look at me, I'm doing this for the sake of Allah and I'm righteous and I'm pious. No, it is something that only Allah knows of. And when you succeed in fulfilling this and in reaching such a level of sincerity, then you would be honorary. You would be honored to be called the slave of Allah and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will take care of you. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.